Oh, we gotta get to the baby. Hello, my friends. My name is Unky, and welcome back to another episode of my time at Sandrock. <laughs> uh, we're terrible. Okay, interact. Yes, yes. Here you go. No baby bottles. Damn it! I did it again. Um, I think my wife might be dealing with postpartum depression. Maybe she's sick of living in a disaster house. Quite possible. Quite possible. Um, are we gonna go straight? To, no, okay. So let's see. We got this new layout, which we're going to fix tomorrow. Let's ride. We got to go get baby bottles. Let's ignore Penny for the moment. Sorry, Penny. I have a baby to take care of. This is so important that we do this. Oh, there's Nia. Hello. Everyone's up bright-eyed and bushy-tailed. Let's see. Off in the distance, I saw someone who looked like you. Upon the closer inspection, it was you. Hey, open the shop. Open up. We haven't talked to Arvio in quite a while. The last time we talked to him, he, we like broke his heart. Let's see. Mm -hmm. uh, I can help with the disappearing Chi situation. If he ever doesn't stop in for his weekly purchase of tea leaves, I'll inform everyone he's been missing for six days at the most. Actually, that's really, really helpful. Mm -hmm. Let's see. What? The forest failed? How could that be? Has anyone contacted Musa? Can we just throw more money at the problem? <laughs> no. That's, that's not how forests work, Arvio. Um, okay, we gotta wait. Now, let's take a look at, before we do this, we have a commission to turn in here. We have this quest from Penny that we need to snatch up. Um, and then, of course, we have the Starship Abandoned Ruins. Now, make sure you have the equipment and medicine you might need for such a dive. I wonder, this might be the main story quest. We could skip that for a day if we were like, really needed to for some reason. The only reason I say that, I think this is enough stamina. I don't think this is enough medicine. I need to go buy more medicine. Also, I think that I want to upgrade the kitty boots and the kitty helmet to max. Um, before, because I think we're gonna be kinda under leveled for the area. We already were under leveled when we went into the tunnel to clear out the monsters. Baby bottle, where are you? Okay, we're gonna just buy all of these. There we go. Um, I don't know if I've bought that. How much is it? $54. We'll buy this. Um, that will allow us to decorate our kids room, which would be really, really cute. Okay. Let's go. Oh my gosh. I love Merle so much. He's so fast. Penny, I'll be there in just a second. Woo! Look at our nice new house. It actually looks pretty nice. I'm happy with it. I have not been happy with any home layout in a long time. I think, is the baby still crying? Yes, the baby is still crying. Okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. There we go. Oh, it's okay, it's okay. Interact, say hello to my child. Um, let's give it a toy. Let's give it. <laughs> let's give the child a toy. Toy paintbrush. Some of these I want to use as decorations. And I don't want to, um, so, so we'll do that in a little bit. Okay, let's see about upgrading our equipment and getting some medicine before we head out there. I know that I said, let's see. Where did all of my stuff go? Oh, you know what? It's probably in, it's probably in mailbox. Holy crap. Tumbleweed standard. Oh my gosh. Hey, look at that. That's fun. You know what that is. Okay, let's see if we can find what are we looking for? Here they all are. Acquire, perfect. Let's see. Um, there's so much of this stuff. Hey, bright kitty helmet. That's um, that's actually better, isn't it? Oh, I wish you could just acquire the one item. Okay, Merle. Oops. Why don't you go back? Interact. Stay right there. 
We actually have a lot of space now. This works. Look at this beautiful house. The only thing I was thinking I could do differently is move this room right here. And this might just be a little too big. I'm not really sure. Let's see. I know I did so much of this the other day, but... The other day being the last video that all of you watched. Let's see, change size. There we go. That looks better, doesn't it? Cute. Okay. Okay, so we can upgrade this. Nice. We don't have enough to do the boots all the way, do we? So that's maxed, beautiful. Kitty boots, we can do these to here. What is this? This is an opal. I'm sure we have something that can we can refine into opal. Where is it? Or refinery, okay. Right there, marble. Do it. Okay, let's say hi to Penny. She's been waiting patiently. Hey, Penny. I need help. Uh, what's it's wrong? My fault. I was so excited. I forgot water and rest. Saying uh, too much. Now so hoarse. I think you need to go to Fang. What could I do for you? The showdown's coming up. What do I do? Um, well, you know what? We were going to go to the clinic anyway, so this is actually fine. You're so kind. Thank you. She's probably just coming to me because I'm the only person she knows, and she's just a little shy, maybe? Come on, Penny. Let's go. Merle. Return. Yakipoo. Let's ride. Hop on, Penny. No? What? Come on! Okay, well, if you're just if we're just gonna walk, let's try this again. Nope. <laughs> okay, well, <laughs> follow me, I guess, because <laughs> I I don't wanna not walk. <laughs> I don't wanna walk. Oh, you know what? We could have taken the bus, too. This is what she gets for not uh, hopping on the back. I wonder if it's like you have to be a certain level of friends or something to do that. Look out! Coming through! Okay, well, I thought we were going to go straight into the ruins, but apparently we're not doing that just yet. Today, we're farting around doing other stuff. That's fine, because that's... Hello, doctor. I'm feeling a little... Horse. He's gonna think that she's making fun of him. Not horse, Raven. Oh God. Is the bird the doctor? Doctor Burbeet. Peculiar. Burdinio Jr. No, this isn't the doctor. I am the doctor. Open your mouth. <laughs> so forward. <laughs> mute, mute. Um. Yes. She is not mute. Vocal cords. Congested. You wrecked yourself. Well, we can just postpone, right? Congestion. Ah, congestion. Yes. Doctor, what should I do? Will I be able to sing? No, listen to yourself. Don't you be four. Ah. <laughs> Sick burn, dude. This bird is on fire right now. Herbal tea. 50 goals. And I'm over. Okay. Here. Thank you, doctor. Drink tea. Don't talk. Thank you. I'm going to drink the tea. Please, take this. Experience. <laughs> well, thank you. Okay, we need to buy a um, medicine bottle. Okay, oh, here we go. We need a bunch of this. Do we have a bunch of strong medicine? The strong medicine might have ended up in the chest, but why don't we 
buy as much of this as we can. Wait, it's right here. Um, and I don't have a problem spending that kind of money. It's fine. Um, dun, dun. Okay, none of that's necessary. Okay, we actually might just be ready. Come, Yakipu. Uh, I don't feel like worrying about any of the commissions right now. I want to see if maybe we got one last opal and then we're going to head on out. We're going to go into this ruins. Oh, it's going to be so great. Oh, I'm so excited. Turn. Dang, we haven't refined one piece of marble yet. Boo. Maybe we have. Yes. Perfect. Here we go. Now, this is... We're, we're not even able to wear this stuff yet. Kitty boots. There we go. Refine. Look at that. Stamina up. So, let's just make sure that we feel... Perfectly equipped. Well, in order to do that, why don't we go... Where is our... Someone told me a little hack to fix the... Um, the the critters getting messed up, but it is a bug. It is a very acknowledged bug. Okay, so we're going to say sort all, confirm. Now let's make sure... God, we really don't need to have all of this stuff, do we? But we have the heart stroke medicine, we have the hemostat, and we have plenty of stuff. What's the stamina one? Yes, yeah, so we're good. Let's just do a little offloading of some of this stuff if we can. Here we go. Um, we can offload that as well. And then I'm not worried about the rest of this stuff, honestly, because this can go in there. The iron ore can go in there too. Okay, are we ready? I think we're ready. Let's do it. We'll leave the commissions for another day. We'll worry about the critters in a, in a minute. Let's go. Oh, look, the magic mirror. Hovers above ground. How cool. Y'all have enough food? Um, yes. Look at that. He loves the tomatoes. I'm happy he likes them. We've ignored everything. We've ignored the letters. I'm not too worried about it. I don't know why the duck takes off way out here. Wouldn't it make sense to be in the middle of town? Maybe um, it just scares the duck too much to be in the middle of town. I don't really know. I guess that would be the only thing I could think of. Are you sure you want to go? Yes. Hey there, partner. I reckon I secure this side early, but it seems like Director Chi still got here before me. He's pretty punctual. I arrived at precisely 3.02 a.m. Holy crap, why? I'm glad you're here. Now we can get started. He's been waiting all this time? <laughs> These penguin dogs are so cute. According to the documents, the entrance to another section of the base is around here. I've narrowed it down as far as humanly possible by walking the distance from the starship wing. Okay. I'm certain this is the section that houses a water reservoir. We must now excavate to reveal the entrance. Okay, fun. Excavate. As in dig. Dang, that wasn't in the mission description. Director, do you know how far down we have to go? No, just dig until we hit metal. Okay, that yeah, makes sense. Uh, all right, let's get to it. If we work together, we're going to find it in no time at all. Let's okay, go. Bob, pick a spot that looks appealing and start digging. Wait a minute, am I just digging out here in the open world? Oh no, there are spots on the map to dig. Let's check it out. Check. <clears throat> there are just rocks under here. The entrance isn't here. Okay, well, this is cute. This is a fun little side quest. Let's go.
Ooh, could it be this? Nailed it. Great job. Looks like you found it. Let me just head in and see. Nope, calm down. Whoa, Odie oh, partner. I know you're excited, but uh, you ain't exactly known for your fighting skills. I reckon me and the builder better head on down first to see what the deal is. Well, we could all head in together, right? Ready? Did you bring, you know, medicine, weapons, the usual? Look at this. It's in red. Okay, I'm ready. This is going to be tough, isn't it? Not for me. Not for me. Maybe we'll get enough experience. We'll hit level 45. That's the hope. Whoa, that is a lot of water. There it is. That's it. Look at that. That's a ton of water. It's far larger than I thought. And that tank must be the reservoir. The machine attached to it must be the atmospheric water generator. Wow. <laughs> Breathe, Chi. Breathe. I, I've said it before, but I will say it again. My One of my favorite things about this game is that all of Chi's dreams come true. All of his, like, uber futuristic science nerd dreams come true, and nothing could make me happier. I need a closer look. I must go. Okay, hold on. Director, wait. What if you... Oh, what a fool. It just dematerializes in front of us. Okay, well, Chi is a forced ghost now. Bye. Ah, oh, crud. Come on. We better catch up with him. That guy has a heck of a brain. But in a fight, well, let's just make sure we're there. Yeah, let's go. Okay, cool. Time has now frozen. Dun, 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 dun. We are going to, so this is how we do this every time. You have seen this a bunch of times now. We are going to smash every box. We're going to peek around every corner. We're going to kill every monster and uh, hope that we clear this place of all of its goodies. Look at all these boxes. Strong medicine, nice, nice, and a throwing bomb. Oh my gosh, something about the latest update just has all the NPCs bugging out. Do you see this? Look at them. What the heck? Oh, it's so bum, it's such, so unfortunate. The pathing really needs help. Oh, do I have bullets? Okay, I have a hundred. That's good. I'm only going to use the bullets for the laser cameras. I've completely forgotten about those. Oh, I think we heard one already, didn't we? Okay, I only have 12 of these. That's not good. I should have brought more. What about, did I bring the assault rifle? No. Okay, so I am not really prepared for this area. Okay. She is fearless. What are you doing? Get to cover. Dang, he's in his own world now. Well, Builder, you know what to do. Okay, I can hear the cameras. I don't see them, but I think those are going to be like, I have to find them and take them out as quickly as possible. Those are going to be my biggest enemy, huh? Okay, let's see how well we fare against this level 50 utility bot. Okay, not too bad. Um, I would say that the most difficult thing, honestly. Director G! Director! On this basis, at any moment, one to five percent of the atmosphere is made of water vapor. The atmospheric water generator takes advantage of this resource provides enough to serve the fabrication facility and the launch center. So if this thing has been converting atmosphere into water, is that one of the reasons that Sandrock became so dry? Fascinating. So a single atmospheric generator can be that powerful. Hey, Director G, can you hear me? Hmm? Oh, you're here too. <laughs> He's so rude. It's a real shame. This is just another tourist pamphlet. 
It doesn't tell me what I want to know. Well, hold tight, bro. Oh. We're gonna get in there. Look around. I expect that the combat AI is to still be functional, but they appear to be destroyed. Director, you gotta be more careful. You can't just stop and read everything you see. If it weren't for me and the builder, you'd be robot toast right about now. Um, I don't think that I'm was sorry. the case. I'll try to be more careful next time. New scientific information is exhilarating. I finished reading everything here anyway. Although I didn't find any technical data, I found out that the generator in this facility can produce at least 100 tons of water per day. That is a lot of water. Holy yak mill! 100 tons! Is it still working? It doesn't look damaged. We need to find the control room for the generator. Then we'll know for sure. That is incredible. Is he gonna run ahead? No, he's going to play nice. Okay, beautiful. Um, I really did not think about needing bullets and I kind of regret it, but you know what? We're just gonna roll with it. We'll be fine. Oh, it's one of the big boys. Let's get all the boxes. There we go. That strong medicine is gonna help. And you know what? I should probably put, where is it? Right there. I don't really need that. We might as well use this up if we need to. I am still afraid of cameras, but apparently it's just the sound of robots. Okay, go get him, Justice. We gotta kill this guy first. Oh my goodness, well, no, he blew up. Oh, he's kicking the crap out of Justice. Oh my goodness. Am I gonna do it? Ooh. Okay, so things are strong here, um, but I have a lot of health and that's good. I would have more health. Oh my gosh, I'm down to 2,000? Okay. Um. Okay, we gotta play way more conservatively than we have been. Oh, this one heals himself. That's right. Did we get everything? I think we did. Okay, let's go. Ooh, no, strong medicine. I don't know if we're gonna hit level 45 while we're down here. Maybe I should have gone and, oh my goodness, this is a lot of guys. Uh, I feel like I should kill these first or I'm gonna be dealing with them healing the whole time. Nothing funnier to me than Chi just standing there watching. Well, it's nice that the heal bots are healing each other. Let's get out of that. There we go. I guess I shouldn't have stood in the mine, but here we are. Okay, so that guy's giving me 300 experience to kill him, right? If justice kills them, do I get any experience? So they're giving me 300 experience each. Ooh. What's this? 143 minus 89. Um, I would have to kill about 180 of those little guys to level up. This is gonna actually be kind of a challenge. Okay, nice. Uh, oh, I guess it's back here then. Let's see, is it a combat point? Yes, it is. Uh, 
Increased magazine capacity of all firearms. That's actually convenient. Let's see. Okay, well, that's a little convenient. Oh, crap. Here we go. We found him. One more shooting. How about that for moves? Do going down. That? I guess that was here. Yes. Will this shock me? No. Oh, God. These guys are strong. Um... Did I store all of my bombs away? Oh, I wish I brought the rifle. All right, we've 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 come in here half cocked for sure, but you know what? We're going to do it. I feel like taking out the lifter bots is the way to go first. I gotta get these guys to do that. There we go. Oh, I ran right, there's like a final blast at the end. Maybe I should kill these utility bots first. I'll just let Justice tank those guys. Oh god, here they come. Oh, I thought there was only three of these guys. Let's kill this one. go got that one yeah this is really <laughs> stressful <laughs> it's not all that challenge well god look at how low my health is already um we might be in for a world of hurt the farther we get into this i'm glad i have enough medicine but whew. well you know what the good news is okay let him do his thing there we go explode oh no he's gonna do his thing again there we go if we can just get one of these guys down, I'll be really happy. Those give a thousand. That's nice. There we go. Okay, perfect. The other thing those utility bots do is they drop those stupid bombs. Masterpiece necklace. It's just a painting of a... <laughs> what? <laughs> That's so weird. <laughs> it's just a painting of a necklace? Okay. You say so. Why did we even come in here? This should be the control room. I'm going to look at the controls. Can you please look around for any documentation? Yes. What about me, Director? How can I help? Stand guard. I don't particularly have faith in your ability to find things. Oh, <laughs> so rude. Shucks. I mean, at least you're honest. Poor Justice, dude. Uh, I mean, <laughs> just look for paper on the ground. How stupid do you think he is? Okay. 
Reservoir Operation Notice. The purification tank is the primary source of water for staff on living on base, as well as ship manufacturing and experimentation. It needs to be kept to the highest standards of hygiene. Personnel entering the reservoir must wear protective clothing. Two, reservoir staff are to patrol daily at 1900. Make the generator room, control room, and public area accessible at this time. Relevant staff will be disinfecting the area. The lowest levels of the reservoir is directly connected to the water pipes for the base and must be patrolled by security AIs at all times. Disruptions to the patrols will not be tolerated. Addendum. Takeout is strictly forbidden. All food is provided at the cafeteria. Outside food can be a critical danger to the atmospheric water generator. If an employee is found to be ordering takeout, 15% will be deducted from their next paycheck. Um, why? Why is takeout forbidden? This is a very, let's see, outside food can be of critical danger. Is this because of pathogens maybe? Interesting, okay. Box, box, control room work log. Okay, well that I was just able to pick up. Um, isn't there, wasn't there one over here? Email records, cool. This, this I can't gather though, I can just check, okay. Um, okay, why don't we, can we read these? Here we go, what am I reading? This is control room log, okay. Spring second, generator normal, reservoir normal. Okay, so this is just the status. Um, okay, external shock detected, spring 12th, all systems shutting down. Is this the day of the calamity? Reservoir, Nancy, honey, please don't order me any takeout again. I love that you care so much, but if they find out, I'll get 15%, take it off my paycheck. Propulsion R&D. Rodriguez, are you serious? But the cafeteria food is terrible. I swear, I tried their spaghetti once. I could have poked a hole in Olympia with it. It was that al dente. Nancy, yeah, I know. They're getting real tight with security now. I don't even know if I'll make it in. Propulsion R&D. Rodriguez, don't worry. It's not for much longer. Soon we'll get on the Olympia and we're off together. Nancy, I know, but I'm worried, Rodriguez. There are talks of war. Bah! The irresponsible ones are the ones pushing us into this stupid confrontation. There's a reason people outlawed enhanced humans a century ago. Don't worry, we'll be off planet soon. Okay, honey, I trust you. I wonder, nope, they didn't make it off because we found the Olympia. I've checked the generator. It seems to be intact. I'm unclear as to whether the rest of the system is still in working condition. Well, let's go check. Let me see the locks. Perhaps there is a record on system integrity. External shock detected. Generator repaired. Maintenance has updated automatic repair units. Troubleshooting will be automatically repeated at regular intervals. Good. It seems the system has an automatic maintenance system. I'll try restarting it. Okay. Welcome to the Olympus 3000 water generation system. Troubleshooting will begin shortly. Troubleshooting complete. System integrity, 100%. All systems functional. Water generation engaged. Amazing. Amazing! That sound. It's water flowing. Yep. It's working. The glory of science. Sandrock is saved. That seems to be the case. Yay for us. <laughs> to be clear, Cute. this is an almost infinite supply of water. As long as the machine is running. Well, therein lies the problem. This is technology far beyond our comprehension. The best thing that we could do is get the free cities, the best minds of, of the free cities down here to try and reverse engineer this thing. Wait, it seems you found something else. What did you discover? Email logs. Interesting. Let me see. Hmm. This transcript record implies that people in the base have plans to leave on the next Olympia launch. They aim to avoid the calamity. I wonder if there is a way for us to contact the human voyagers traveling these starships. Think of all the knowledge we could gain. I wonder why they haven't tried to contact us. It's going to be really tragic if none of them survived. Uh, Director, I think you're kind of getting a little away from our mission here. Well, he's allowed to just dream. <laughs> Don't spoil cheese oh, dreams. Sorry. My mind was wondering. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's head on back and tell the mayor the good news. Um, I want to gotcha. look around. Let me know when you're ready. Have we 
done everything? Was that it? Oh, that was it? Really? Oh, that was so easy. I thought this was gonna be way harder. Um, okay, well then let's head back. Wow, that's nice. You ready to roll out? Yeah, let's go. I seriously thought it was gonna be so much more difficult than that. I'm kind of sad there wasn't I a great like big bob. A uh, boss helping clearing the entrances to the starship runes. It would be easier for me when I come back for further research expeditions. Good thinking. Now that our main source of water would be from here, gotta make it more accessible, right? Thanks for your hard work today. I'm gonna take the director and go report this to Mayor Trudy. We'll see what she wants to do next. You take it easy now. All right. Nice, Rainbow Dinosaur Senior Jacket. Okay, well we gotta check this thing out. Whoa, this thing is awesome. Oh my God, I love this. Love, love, love it, hold on. Can we go full rainbow? Yes, we're going full rainbow. You know what, we could go full rainbow, but I kind of feel like the eyeballs, how do we feel about the eyeballs in the rainbow? Hmm. What other capes do I have? Is that it? And then there's the shark one. Oh, I love this jacket. Oh my God. It's so good, right? It's so good. Um, okay, can we get, isn't there this one? There we go. That's a little better. Ooh, I like the dark pants with this. Can we get, Okay, 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 we're on to something here, folks. We're on to something here. We just need the best boots possible. Is this the boots that work? They might be. Look, they match the gloves. Ooh, I love it. Do we go full rainbow, though, or do we... Um, I'm just struggling with the cape choice. I sort of feel like, okay, that doesn't work even a little bit. Get it out of here. I think we have to go full rainbow. Don't you? Look, oh, so good. So good. Oh my gosh, I love this outfit. Let's go. Okay, well that was just a little too easy. I was so stressed about it. That's funny. Will that become another like combat ruins that we can play around in? I hope so. Um, come Daisy. Um, cause that would be a ton of fun. Where are you, where are you at Merle? Let's go. Hey, we still have a lot of time. So in the last episode, we, we set up the bones for a brand new house and now we have to finish it. That's our goal. And I can't think of anything else to do today. Well, there is a few things that we could do. We could finish these commissions, right? Why don't we start? Let's track this one. Uh, we were just there with Justice. I'm sure this stuff, did we, did we? I'm surprised we don't have this stuff yet. Let's turn this into Jensen. Let's finish the other ones and let's see if we can't decorate up a storm. Can't think of a better way to spend the rest of today, woo! Here you are, Mr. Jensen. Oh, hey oh, hey there. Uh, firm? Thank you. Okay, let's chat it up a little bit. Mm -hmm. Had a chat with Professor Le. Turns out he collects trains too. <laughs> Yay, Jensen's got a friend. I got him in on the newsletter. He didn't even know we had one. A great addition to the train enthusiast community of free cities. So cute. Mm. Anything the train station can do to help the forest situation? I'm saying this as a last resort, but if you need one of our passenger cars converted into something to transport fertilizer, we'll do it. Hey, uh, so long, partner. that's awesome. Tap, 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 tap. Look out, look out, here I come. Um, I guess I don't need this to do the rest of this. Why don't we cancel that? We already have plenty, so we need a little more organic stuff. Um, let's check the mail. Okay, from Construction Junction, a picture frame. Due to changes in your home, some items have been moved. Okay, 
We, um, let's see, Tumbleweed Standard. School's in forever. Sound the bell, school's in session. Actually, I'm not sure we have a bell, but you get the idea. Sandrock now retakes its position as a major city-state in the Alliance by meeting all municipality standards as established by the Alliance Council. Go us. This is so awesome. This school has just been one of the many recent developments representing our meteoric rise, and this plucky reporter likes to believe that the best is yet to come. We had a quick word with the new teacher, Jane, on what to expect from her curriculum. Who is writing this? Heidi. Heidi is so incredible. Um, I'm here to build an environment where the children of Sandrock can grow. I believe in not just the power of reading, writing, and arithmetic, but also the joy of art and song and participation, she said. Looks like we can expect our kids to be brimming with knowledge and culture in no time. I, for one, will be sitting front row at one of Miss Jane's upcoming school plays. So cool. What's this? Savvy scientist seeks to solve Sandrock's setback. Reported by Heidi. I love that she does these like... Word plays. Hardly a few days since our recent run-in with a wall over at the Eufaula Outback and already we're hard at work on a solution. City Hall has managed to get in touch with a leading expert on the subject of soil and planting from Highwind. Professor Lo, the esteemed academic, has already taken an interest in local planner Zeke's work. Local planner, local botanist. One of Professor Lo's hallmark achievements includes the work he did on fertilizer for his doctorate degree. By identifying a key nitrate molecule, he was able to design a new type of fertilizer that can be used in various climates and locations. This is actually really cool. Professor Lo is the best we've got. When he and Zeke get together, I'm sure we'll reach a solution. His assistant, Nia, said in response, clearly these two are extremely qualified to help our resident soil expert, Zeke, find a breakthrough to get us through that planting problem that has plagued us so pertinently. Amazing. Letter from Rianne. Dear Anki, hey, we just got out of the clinic last night and I'm a father. I'm, it's a healthy baby girl. Oh, I could cry. This is so exciting. Hey, and you know what's so cute about this? Rianne's girl and my girl are basically the same age. They're a couple days apart. They'll get to grow up and be friends together. I feel, I just feel like the most blessed guy in the whole world right now. The whole babies won't let you sleep thing is real, but we're managing. I think you're try trying too hard. Let me tell you about babies. You just leave them in the crib all day and chuck them a bottle once in the morning and they're fine. <laughs> That's all you got to do from what I can tell. Okay, just wanted to spread the joyous news. Stop by and meet the baby sometime. Can we go do that? Letter from Ma. Oh, so we can. Yes, we have to do this today. Letter from Ma. Dear Unky, I heard you fixed the school. That's such good news. I was talking to your pa about whether you'd move back to Highwind when your contract is over, but I think you'll probably settle in Sandrock, won't you? I don't blame you. You've worked so hard to make Sandrock what it is now. Is the new teacher nice? Reply, the new teacher's called Jane. She's lovely. She's really beautiful. I heard she was an actor. The new teacher's called Jane. She's lovely. She's really talkative and confident. I think she'll be a great teacher. Isn't she not confident? We're kind of talking her up. What's this one? She's really beautiful. I heard she was an actress. She was an actress for a while in Walnut Grove. I think the children are going to love her. Um, I don't need to be calling women that aren't my spouse beautiful, but lovely, I think is appropriate. Here we go. Okay. Yo, into it. Thank you. So your DLC purchase is because of your trust and continued support that we're able to work hard to make Sandrock a possibility. Hey, we love you, dev team. And uh, Far East Furniture Pack. Look at this. I spent all of it. Look at all of these fun goodies. Elegant wardrobe. We have upgraded, my friends. Okay, so these are actually pretty cool. Do we have an elegant bed? Yes, we do. Is it a single bed? No, it's a large bed. Nice. Um, we are going to need to acquire all of this. Hopefully it doesn't completely overwhelm our inventory, but we have a lot of free space in our inventory, so I think it'll be okay. Oh, and the relics. Is this all just the relics? It looks like it. I'm actually gonna leave those in there for a moment, okay. I wanna do this right now. I know I said I was going to get the house set up, but I definitely want to go take care and see about this first before anything else. But let's make sure that we have queued up one organic sheet and one canvas before we take off. I think one thing that's nice is the factory. Oh my God, why is my ladder gone? 
I don't understand why this keeps changing. It's very frustrating. Okay. We can actually queue up 99 of these. I'm just gonna do that and let it run because, um, okay, hold on. This is so annoying that this ladder keeps disappearing. I have done this so many times now. Um, I don't know what I'm doing wrong that's causing this to happen. Okay, confirm. And then the one that I put in the corner, oh God, annoying. The one I put in the corner here is gone too. Okay. Um, we're not gonna fart around with these just yet. Can I get to my roof? Yes! Hey. Come, Merle. We have friends to visit. We gotta see their new baby. I don't know how much decorating I'll actually get done today. We will find out. Hey there! Hello, hello there! Unky, come to welcome the newest member of the Sandrock family. I just learned from a very reliable source her parents that her name is Lyndon. That is such a cute name. But I think the nickname Linlin -Lin has already stuck. Linlin? -Lin? Isn't Linlin? -Lin, um, never mind. Hmm. I just saw her. Isn't she precious? <laughs> I've never seen our old friend Dan be more pleased. She's glowing with pride. Hmm? Ah, the miracle of motherhood. Oh, what's that, Professor Luh? I kind of want to... Here we go, just bugging out again every time. I sort of like the idea of Trudy and Professor Luh as a couple. What do you think about that? I'm shipping it. Mm -hmm. Here's the real miracle. I saw Rian changing diapers. <laughs> I know, saw the packaging in the foreground. He's already gone through half a pack. And though he gently put a little... Li and then he gently put Lil Lin Lin. Lin. Oh, Lil Lin, okay, in her crib without so much as a peep. Sure would have been nice to have that kind of gumption around when Elsie was a newborn. Um. What? <laughs> yeah, Cooper. <laughs> you freaking slug. <laughs> Come on, Coop. You hated changing diapers so much. There were tears rolling down your cheeks, and then that would get Elsie start crying, and then... <laughs> <laughs> Look at the face on both of these two. This guy has checked out. He does not want to hear it. And she's like remembering this memory with like the tr like with trauma. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, well, I powered through. Changed some diapers while dealing with an overwhelming emotional distress. That makes me twice the man old pencil neck, pencil, ma pencil maker of a bee. Elsie and I were crying together. It was a bonding experience. Is that what it was? This right here, this is the face of a wife that loves her husband enough to let him BS in front of her without saying anything. Oh my gosh, I hate the pathing so much. <laughs> now, now, it's not a competition. Let's just be proud of our friend Rianne for really stepping up. He's already carved up plenty of little wooden toys for his daughter too, and even gave one to Jasmine. That is adorable. <laughs> Freaking try hard. Try to make us look, other paws look bad. Uh, they... <laughs> <laughs> don't look at me. <laughs> they don't have to try that hard. I just leave my baby at home all day. <laughs> I think it's really funny that this quest exists and they talk about all the things you can do with your child. And then the uh, amount of interaction you can actually do with your baby is so small. Okay. Maybe, or maybe I'm just screwing it up. Who knows? You'll all tell me. I'm sure. Uh, no one's questioning anybody here, but hey, let's... Uh, Let's stop holding you up, Bunky. You're here to see the baby, right? I think we were all just leaving. See ya. Indeed. So long, everyone. Aww, so cute. What a little, they're little jelly beans. It's adorable. Go to sleep, go to sleep. Hey there! Hey, Anki, you came. We welcome to this world Linden, our daughter. 
The linden tree has one of Dan Dan's favorite flowers and the linden basewood is just some of the most beautiful lumber you could ever lay hands on. So just seemed like the perfect name for the most perfect part of our marriage. Okay, hold on. The linden tree, let's check this out. Okay, images. Ooh, that is a gnarly looking tree. Ooh, storm knocks down last original linden tree in Washington Park four days ago. Well, that's unfortunate. Um, these are the flowers that you're talking about? Really? Oh, they're pretty neat. If we could get a cool, like, up-close photo, can we get a better photo of these? The hardy and popular linden trees. Oh, they are cute. This is definitely a botanist flower, right? They're like, this is not a flower that, like, anyone's walking by is like, oh, my God, look at that flower. But if you study it, you're like, wow, look at these. Okay. These are, um... Awesome looking. The 600 year old linden tree in my village. Wow, that is an incredible looking tree. Look at that thing. It's beautiful. Okay, well, then I think it's a great name. Hmm? You want to meet Linlin? Yeah, come on in, but be kind of quiet. She's sleeping. Aww. I love that we just became friends with Rian. Hmm. Dang, I gotta work harder if I want a leading wood expert to come to Sandrock. Although, I can't really think of who that would be. The thing about wood is, it's kind of like wood. Okay, that's super random. Mm -hmm. For the tree thing, don't think of it as a failure. Think of it as finding new ways that don't work. That's a really good point, actually. That's just life. Finding the things that don't work and checking them off the list. Eventually, you get to the thing that works. <laughs> Professor Lo is super famous in the planting community. He even helped me design the brochures we give, in a, we give out at the temple. Oh, I could get one autograph, couldn't I? Oh. Gah, it's so frustrating to be a foot soldier in the war against the desert when nobody has any orders. Have you heard anything from Zeke yet? Still nothing? Urgh. She has so much on her mind right now. Hmm. I want to do some planty today. I have some sweet pet. I have some sweet potato pepper seeds, but what if I had more? Um, do I? Ha I don't think I have any See seeds. See you around. Bye. When did this become their house? Don't they have a bigger house? Oh yeah, we're upstairs. We just went straight here. Merle, let's ride. Canvas, okay, we didn't get any of the, um, what is it called? The ceramic stuff yet, so we gotta wait a little bit. That's fine. Um, as much as I like to stay on top of the Hello Critters, um, the commissions, I'm not gonna worry about that. We're so short on time today, and I wanna get as much decorating done as possible. I don't want to abscond from my duties. Um, there it is. I think I'm just going to continue to buy hens from now on because I think they grow up at slightly different days. And I'm really just raising the chickens to make money. Hello? Hello? They look like they might be low on food, yes. Okay, Merle. Return home. See ya. All right, let's see what we can do about this house. Now, I actually have an idea for this room. Where is my fancy wardrobe? Let's check this thing out. There we go. I want to see what it looks like. Oh, I don't have everything in it. Why don't we come over here? Oh, hungry? It's okay. There you go. There you go. Um, let's see. At pick up. Put in inventory. Beautiful. Let's come back over here. I want to see. My rescue boots are somewhere else, clearly. We'll do that. 
Um, I guess we'll put the magic adventurer boots here. There we go. No, that's not the right ones. Where are the rescuer pants? Oh, they're all messed up. Oh, that's annoying. Okay, um, can we go like this? There we go, yes. We can just leave that blank, I guess. Let's see. Oh, and it puts the hats on the side. That's so cute. Okay. Um, let's check out some of the new wallpaper in here. The change material. Let's see. First of all, wall. Ooh, I like this rusted, like, finely crafted wood. Okay, a little bright. A little bright to walk in. Ooh, I don't mind this at all, actually. Oh, I like this one, too. Okay, let's see that. The roof? Let's look at the roof. No, it's kind of like a bathroom. Ooh. Well, it's a little bold. I guess the roof in the is the same, huh? Cobblestone. That's sort of funny. This is really wild. These are... Oh, this is a lot of interacting patterns, isn't it? Can I get something a little more calm? There we go. That's nicer. I sort of like this floor just for the house. It's pretty, right? Let's see. What others do we have? I think we've seen the rest of these, haven't we? Yeah, I'm kind of partial to hardwood floor. I have really, ooh, ooh, there's, there's some pizzazz there. I'm just gonna go back to that other one that I saw. I really like it. Where is it? This one, this is beautiful, right? Um, You know what would be nice is if we could switch rooms easily. This ceiling is, I don't know. It's sort of like bathroom ceiling or something. I don't know that I like that roof. Can we find something better? Maybe a wooden ceiling? I actually don't hate that with this wall. Okay. Whew. I don't know which ceiling is the far east ceiling. Let's do, let's start by getting everything. Ooh, that's cozy. I like that. The thing about this wallpaper is that it needs to go with a lighter floor or it's going to feel, that's not bad. Ooh. Thing about stone tile is it's very cold. I don't want it to feel cold when I'm in here. Some of these are so uh, outrageous. I'm actually shocked at the sheer variety of tile. Is that wood? Okay, I like that. So I guess the Far East is called Elegant, huh? What about that rug? Is there an Elegant rug? Okay, nice. Ooh, I like this arch better. Those are just nicer, aren't they? Very much, very much nicer, okay. Ooh, that's cool. Oh, we should put a chandelier in this room. Um, the other thing we can do, I guess I could go buy more of these, but we have, just to get them out of my inventory. There we go. I feel like I have one or two more, but maybe I haven't picked up them yet. I don't even remember taking this selfie. That's great. I love that. Okay. <clears throat> Still one of my favorite photos of all time is this photo. This photo makes me so happy. There we go. Beautiful. Dun, dun. Oh, I have one more wooden display closet. Okay. I think the vast majority of my stuff is in storage somewhere, isn't it? I don't like that color in this room. Oh, you can put them right on the floor. That's nice. This space right here needs something, doesn't it? Where's my Yak Boy rocking chair? You know what we could do is we could put a desk right here. That is not what I want in this room. We do have these purple hydrangeas. Those can go in the kitchen, I think. What is this yak boy painting? That 
seems to work in here, doesn't it? Does this clash? I sort of feel like it does. We definitely could use a couple more light sources, don't you think? Small ceiling light? Yeah, right here. Or maybe over the desk? Oh, maybe further in the corner. There we go. Um, okay, so we're going to need a couple more of these chairs. What chair is this? Here we go. We can have some fun in here. Ooh, that's like a cool carpet. Is that too clashing? I feel like it is. I think we just need like a regular ceiling, something like that. There we go. Okay, um, let's see, what fun things can we put in here? Well, we can put the cute lazy sofa in here, right? There we go, adorable. We'll put this on the wall. Bzzz. Cool. There we go. We need some light in here though. Um, I think a ceiling fan would be nice. Is that going to conflict? Yeah, it kind of doesn't work. What else do we have that's cute? Oh, we can put the kid's tent. Yes. Oh, it's gigantic. Oh my God. That's like, uh, I don't know. That takes up the whole room. I would need to make this room a little bigger. We'll leave it, but that's really big, isn't it? Okay, gentle standing lamp. Here we go. This can actually go right here. We'll move this to, I don't know, right here. Um, we're gonna actually, wait, cancel. We're gonna retrieve this. It's just too big. This is so creepy. We could put a clock in here, I guess. There we go. That's not bad. Pottery. I mean, there's nothing less safe than a pottery in a kid's room. Okay, it's coming along. Here we go. How in the world do I go... <laughs> the way it just like drops the baby on the ground is so funny. <laughs> Hold on. Okay, there is a couple more things we need in here, but this is not bad. Bedroom. Ooh, that's nice. These can actually go in the living room, I feel like. I think it's important to have a brighter color on the ceiling, otherwise you feel like you're in a cave. Um, Where is this fancy bed that we got? There we go. Wait, so we can go, then we can go retrieve. Nice. Okay, they're mismatched, but that's okay. This door does not work here. Big open space right here. Like a, a Yak Boy rocking chair would be really nice. Next to a bookshelf. If only the bookshelf wasn't so stupid. I'm gonna put it in here just to fill up this corner, um, but it sucks. We've talked about this many, many times. Okay, well, it's starting to feel like a room, is it not? But I definitely feel like I'm missing. Taking a break? I'll join you. Oh, hello. I used to think the best home would have fountains and a moat and, you know, arches. But since being married to you, I really do think home is where the heart is. I'd still like a moat, though. <laughs> okay, I'll, I'll put it on the honeydew list. A moat, hey? You know what? Everyone dreams. Everyone's got great big dreams. Okay, child. Hey, I wanted to talk to you about something. We've been married a while now. How'd you feel about having a child? She wants to have another one? Another one? We suck at having this one. Let's do it. Great. Well, I'll have to make sure I balance work properly. I can't go tiring myself out. I gotta tell Pa and Grandma. I can't believe we're gonna have another child. 
all already. We're out of our minds. Okay, this is bare bones, but it's okay. Let's look in here. Okay, now this is the kitchen. So we can obviously go with um, something like this. I actually like this. It's got some life to it. Now, what wall would go with purple like that? Ooh, I sort of like it. Uh, not quite. Mm. No. Ooh, I, that might actually work. Nope, that's a bathroom. That's a bathroom. This might actually be all right. Oh, you know what we don't have? We don't have windows anywhere, do we? Our house is completely windowless. Okay, we have to fix that before we do anything else. Can we add windows from here? No, we can only add doors. Let's put windows on the outside. Of course she's bugging out. Um... Mm. I guess, let's see. I guess this made more sense here. How does that, oh no. Oh no. Okay, hold on. Do these just stack up? No, they just placed randomly. Uh, I wish that that was better. What about over here on the desk? Oh, this is actually a better place to have books, right? Nice. Okay, we need windows. Can't believe I didn't put any windows on the house. Oh, it's getting late. Okay, we're just putting very basic windows in for now. We'll change this later. Um, It doesn't make sense to me to have a window right here, but this empty space is a little lame. Not much we could do about it. I don't really want to connect the bedroom to the factory, though. I really want to keep them separate. One thing... Oh, no, I don't want to move anything because it'll screw everything up again. Okay, check. Okay, well, here's the rest of my furniture. Nice. Should we go turn this stuff in right now? One thing, you know what I could do? Yes, I could turn this in right now just to get it out of the way, but I do want to come over here and I want to get a little more of this like furniture. Thank you. There you go. Mm. I think we can all learn something from Trudy's leadership. When you don't know the way forward, you ask the experts. I'm confident Zeke and Professor La will be able to figure out what the problem is. <sighs> I hate to see Trudy look so defeated. Nothing can keep her down for long though. I'll bet she's gonna bounce back with more determination than ever. It's so cute that he has a picture of his wife on his piano. Hey, Vivi. Have we chatted with her in a while? Hello. Mm. It's so lovely see you reunited with your old friend. How's it going? Pick right up where you left off or maybe need a little time to get there again. Mm. So I've heard the planting isn't going as well as anticipated. That's all right, dear. We've been through worse and you just sleep on it and we'll know what to do soon. I promise. See you. I believe it. <laughs> what I would like to get is at least, because I think we can come over here, right? And this will have, yes, I want, oh, you can only buy one at a time. That's unfortunate. I don't need another desk. I could get an elegant lamp. We have that. I think that's fine. What could we sell? Can we sell anything that we don't need? We could sell some of this furniture. I may do that eventually, but I'm not going to worry about that right now. Did I get a wardrobe? I meant to get a wardrobe. 
Yes, I did. Should I get another couch? I'm gonna buy another couch just to be on the safe side. And I like these desks. I might use these desks as end tables. There are two goals, so it's not that big of a deal. Ooh, is this pay to win? Hold on. Oh, it is a little pay to win because <laughs> they give you stats. Oh, well. It's not like I've been struggling. I went into the... I went into an area zoned for level 50 to 52 earlier today. Uh, chair noises, sorry, I'm readjusting myself. And was able to kick everything's ass being, oh, I don't know, level 46 levels behind. So I don't think it's a big deal. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Thank you. There you go. Mm -hmm. Went ahead and did a little background check on old Professor Lowe. Turns out he's completely legit. Absolutely zero chance that he's been anything other than a plant nerd over at that botany school his entire life. That makes sense considering that we got totally bamboozled by uh, fake Bronco the kid that turned out to be Andy. I mean, a child basically scammed us, so. Um... I guess my whole take on the tree thing is nothing wrong with getting something wrong. But when you don't know why you failed, that's when folks start getting nervous. Hope we figure this out and quick. We don't have to worry about anything. We found a hundred tons of water a day. We're going to be exporting water at that rate. We'll be able to completely greenify this. But again, the problem is that if that breaks down at some point, then Sandrock is screwed. I will say, though, it has been... It hasn't decayed or it hasn't fallen apart in what, 400 years that it's been running? So we probably have very, very little to worry about. Oops. <laughs> da, da, da. Interact, uh, return home, there you go. I'll worry about stocking that with clothes later. I love the idea that my closet is right when you walk in. That's so funny. Okay, let's see. Um, This is really cute, but don't you think it would make sense framing the bed? So let's see. I thought I bought another one of these. Did I not? There's our sweet baby. It's probably really in uh, insulting to put these like ancient relics in the kids room, <laughs> but I don't care. <laughs> I'm just a rebel like that techno table. Um, This sort of makes sense in here. I don't know, maybe. Oh, you know what? Yes. It's a diaper changing table, is it not? Oh, we could put the little, uh, there we go. And then we could put a little book on uh, taking care. Time to care. call it a day. Hope I have a good dream. I hope you do too, darling. Okay, a little sparse over here. Windows or something on this wall would be really nice. Is she going to just say hi to her baby? So cute. We have uh, completely ignored the kitchen. I don't know why the wall changed to this. What was it before? I think I actually like this. Maybe because we put windows on it. I want to say that the yak is right here. The, um, no, not the yak. Well, my stable is right here. Let's put this over here like that. There is a sink, isn't, th don't we have a sink? I feel like the kitchen is always the easiest thing to get working in this, uh... Will this go under here? Um, I hate that. I 
It's just a little small in here, isn't it? There we go. Why does everything fit so goofy in this game? It's very dim in here. Which lights did we use? I think we used these. But I think I want to use... I like these can lights a lot. That's better lighting, isn't it? We need something right here in the corner. <laughs> that actually works. It's that thing that it's doing where it's just one off. Oh, it drives me nuts. Oops. There we go. It's good enough, isn't it? We don't have nearly enough photos of us. There. Cool. Hey, we have a little cozy kitchen up and running again. I like it. Um, you know what this room could use? This room could use a Meowth statue right there. What do you know? Is this gonna be off by one? It is. Ugh. It's like I need to make every single room just one one bigger. Let's put that in the corner. Don't we have another elegant lamp? Let's do that right here. There we go. See that? This is just slightly off. Okay, perfect. Ooh, that's nice. That's nice. Uh, this could maybe go in the bedroom, actually. Um, I'm going to move this photo. Maybe right there. Holy crap, this is way too big. We have no place to put this. Will it fit here? I need to make this room just one wider. Well, I have plenty of space. It's gonna mess everything up, but that's okay. What was it? What did I just have here? I just had, this looks dumb. It's like clipping into the wall. Don't I have some cactus I could put in here? Adorable. This could go in the baby's room. Oh, that's right. This was going to go here. <laughs> I love it. It's so freaking huge. <laughs> it cracks me up every time I see it. Um... Okay, look at this cute little room. I feel like this rug though, let's see, move, maybe something more like that. Just a little bit better of a space filler. Um, And then I might get maybe another sofa if this room gets a little bigger and just have like one facing here, just a little more hangout. But this is, this is not bad. Do I have anything else that I'd want to put in here? Not really. Okay, confirm. I have this massive space right here. Absolutely massive. Okay, hold on. We do have... Put that there. We don't have a lot of pictures on the wall. We could move this to here. It's like a big bureau. There we go. This space needs... I don't know what it needs. Why don't we do this? Retrieve this. Put this right there. There we go. I am going to put this thing in here. I don't like it. <laughs> it's so terrifying, but whatever. <laughs> it's. <laughs> I still think this thing is going to murder me in my sleep. Oh wait, I have a second elegant couch. Didn't I say that I wanted a second elegant couch? Does that change things? It kind of does, doesn't it? If we do something like that, that's gonna block the door. Dang. Can we get it to fit over here? Not quite, huh? Ooh. Well, I guess that is okay. Where'd my wardrobe go? Oh, that's right. Oh, I wish it just went right back in here. 
instead of, is this in the way? It kind of is in the way. I wish it went back into this instead of in the mailbox. It's a little annoying that it does that, but oh well. Um, I still think I don't quite have enough art in my room. Well, the art that I'm choosing to put up, not that great. Let's put this, um, you know what we could put in here, I guess? Whoa, didn't know we could clip into the closet. Put a little sofa, there we go. That way if we wanna hang out in the bedroom. Is that too close? I don't think it's too close. We got clashing patterns here, but I'm not too worried about that. I can always, as I acquire more of the um, this furniture, fix that. It is also very dim in here. I cast a lot of shadow. Wish these were a little brighter. Oh well. Um. Well, darn. I know that I want this propeller in here, right? Da -da 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 -da. Okay. Hey, this is pretty cute. Look at my cute little house. Okay. Um, let's see. Not a lot going on in here. That's okay. We could put a big chandelier when you walk in here. That's pretty well centered. Uh, and then we have a couple more relics that you could get introduced to as you walk in. So we got that one. Um, I guess that's all I have at the moment, huh? You know what I need to do is put a chest in my uh, house that I don't... Whoa, hello, Magic Mirror. Ooh, I have sand running boots. Remember when I was like, I don't have any of the sand running equipment? Looks like I do. Not nearly as much stuff as I thought. I thought I had way more. Okay, nice. Let's look here. These are really, really early game equipment. That's kind of fun. And then if I'm not mistaken, there was no Civil Corps pants. I was just using Desert Defender pants, right? But wasn't there Desert Defender boots? Civil Corps boots, there we go. So let's look at this. There's all the froggy gear, early stuff. Here's the fun, unique outfits, okay. Let's talk about the fancy stuff. Let's put a whole thing of fancy stuff in here, right? Okay, nice. Oh, so cool, I am so cool. Time to call it a day. Hope I have a good dream. I hope you do too, my love. Okay, here we go, light adventurer. Is there no desert warrior hat? Seat adjusted. I'm probably messing up the audio with how much I'm moving the seat around. I've been recording this one episode for two freaking hours. Okay, so we're gonna put, I guess this one, cause it's the brighter, it's kind of prettier. We want a cool cross section of everything. So that's gonna go there. Did I never get light adventure boots? Apparently not. Oh, look, there is Civil Corps pants. Oh, good. Perfect. Light Adventure goggles, Light Adventure shirt, Light Adventure bottoms. I guess not. Okay, well we gotta do the flaming action stuff. But I guess I don't have Light Adventure boots. Well, then we're gonna have to do it the other way. Am I wearing them? Is that what's going on? No, cause I can wear stuff and have it I love that this outfit came together. This sucks that the pants clip through the boots like that, but whatever. Weird, I feel like I'm missing some of my stuff. Oh well, we'll just do those, it'll be fine. Look at my closet that you see when you first walk in so I can get geared up, geared up as I go out. All right, well, there's one last thing that we gotta do, but I'm not gonna do it right now because I've been recording for two hours, is we need to make sure we need to spruce up the outside. The outside is still very bare bones, but you know what? That's okay. Construction junction. Oh, you know what? I'll bet some of that stuff just ended up here. It is kind of lame that it goes here and not back into your inventory. 
No, I guess not. I guess not. I don't know where the rest of my outfits are, but you know what? I'm not too worried about it. It's not like I'm short on outfits. All right, my friends. Thank you so much for watching to the end. Hit the like button and subscribe. Leave a comment. We um, had a much easier day than I thought we were going to have, truthfully. Because we didn't have to, like, fight a giant boss. Which, honestly, I'm a little sad about. I think it would have been a lot of fun. Is this not harvestable? Oh, it is harvestable. Let's harvest it. Um, so, tomorrow, who knows what's going to happen. I guess probably a lot of exciting stuff now that we've got access to just an obscene amount of water. Hopefully, we'll have a solution to the reforestation problem. And we can get Sandrock back on track. All right. I appreciate you all so much. I bid you farewell, and I really look forward to seeing you all next time.